I filled up the basic details. Now this is audit observation profile. Here you can see. So it's not very much useful as of now. So the way, then we continue to the third part, the key documents. So here is the thing. <coughs> In key documents, uh, you will get two options to upload your key documents. One from attached form library and the other one is for attached. If you opt this one, it will directly open your it will directly ask you to select file and you can drag down your particular file from your uh, laptop, macbook or system anywhere. If it is in the system, then it will appear in this option attached. But if you have already downloaded OIOS app, I will, uh, I will share the link of that particular OIOS, OIOS app in the description. <coughs> In the description so that you will be able to download that you have to log in uh, with the same account which is registered in OIOS and uh, then you that will work as a drive it means that if you scan any document over there and rename that particular document it will appear here like I have already um, uploaded that particular document key document in my OIOS app so it will appear it will appear the entire uh, documents I scan till now. So internet is not very well, so I think so. We have to keep a little patience. That's all we have. You can see that multiple documents open. <coughs> you can, if you have any like doubt, if you forget to write to rename that particular document, you can click over here, then it will open that particular file. Then you can know that whether it's the connected KD or not. So I have put terminal charges over here. So I have checked the box of that particular document which I need to upload and then I attach it. <coughs> you can select multiple uh, documents. You can select from uh, attach from my library to uh, like that. Okay, I'll show you the other one. Uh, I have one uh, railway port order. So I'm going to attach that particular from my MacBook. So, so I'm going to drag it from here to here. So you will get an option of whether its category is an extra document. So I select key documents. If, if it's nothing, then you can opt as general also. So I attach over here. So this is the way you at, you have two options to attach your key documents. Then we further proceed. <coughs> so this will show you the history, what you added, and step by step. So you just there is a sub para. If you have sub para, right now we don't uh, like jump on sub para option. So we will just continue. then we will review this para if you want to change you later on you can change and don't worry about the size of that uh, words keywords because you can alter that size of that keywords later on so this is the thing the originator name date and everything will be shown up so next you just hit the continue button finally <coughs> sorry uh, so finally you are on the action page where you have few options if you want to send for review 
you can opt for you, this option uh, you need to send to your branch officer or WOs or any anyone if you want to send to approval you, you will do the same you just type out the name and just put something in the noting what to see and so here I'm going to directly issue this para and this uh, forwarding note is like uh, automatically generated so no need to worry so let it be as it is and due date whether it's up to you whether you want to uh, put that date or not so I'll put it here it's optional so it's not mandatory and I'm going to issue it so here I hit the finish button 